Hey there guys, how are you all doing? This is here Vibro again from Tech Tweak Team and so today in this video I'll be showing you or telling you the best version of Phoenix that is available for playing games like PUBG and overall performance and so this is it guys. So recently there was an update came that came to the Phoenix OS that is the 3.5.0.64 which is nothing just addition of ads which are really really useless and for us for we uh, we want a really ad free environment of course and also we do care about the performance but there the performance was really bad i tried it myself uh, the things that i saw was that there were more ads and there was more lag when i was just playing the game it was lagging so much that the game used to like stutter for like one or two seconds and at the next moment when the game resumes i'm a dead man so that's really uh bad and i was very much annoyed with this fact and so what i did i downgraded myself from 3.5 to 3.0.8 this is the best version that i have ever found which is like so good there is no bugs everything is working like microphone Wi-Fi is working like everything is working out. I won't say that 3.5 uh, had some major bugs It's just there was no improvement in the game and overall stability of Phoenix OS Only they were just adding up more and more ads Even though I showed you one like tutorial how you can get the free VIP uh, by using lucky patcher if you remember but even that is not a permanent fix and I, re I realized after doing that uh, like for one or two days it was fine but from the third day uh, the ads started appearing again which is very very annoying and there was no way that you can stop and also there used to be a TikTok application uh, icon over at the top or uh, over here which you can never uninstall or remove and but I uh, was a few of my subscribers did uh, reply me that so uh, on to that factor so I'll keep that aside so yeah so that 3.5 update was totally worthless so don't update as a youtuber and as a uh, well seeker for you I would suggest you stick with the version of Phoenix that you are right now if you are on a older version of phoenix right now just there is no freaking way of updating it to 3.08 or something but all the users who have upgraded to 3.5 i would suggest you please come back to 3.08 it's far better and this the official version of phoenix uh, i'll be talking about more uh, about the other versions of Phoenix that are out there. So for now, I'm talking about the official version and this is just the best version. If And now you want to download this, but uh, from the official uh, Phoenix OS page, you cannot find it. So I would be showing you where you can find. Just go ahead to your web browser and search for Phoenix OS 3.0.8 and just search it. And there will be um, a link the file cluster.com don't worry i'll be posting the link of this uh in the description so you can just go ahead and hit the download button and you will be able to download it for free so after downloading it uh, install it in normal way and remember guys don't forget to watch my video about upgrading or downgrading phoenix os without losing any data because i know it's very much pain in the ass for downloading pubg mobile or any other games again from the play store because the size of the game are so much big so do remember that so the link of this uh website will be in the description so you can go ahead and download this thing up so you can click on the external mirror right here and a download will start up with no problem as you can see it says speeding up your downloads because i don't want to download it again so i'll be just pausing this thing up and just close this up and so that's pretty much it so that this is the official version of Phoenix. So now I'll be, I want to talk about the ROC version of Phoenix that we have right here, which if you don't know what ROC is, it's a modded version of Phoenix that was released by some developers. Uh, so the full form of ROC is Republic of Champions, if I'm not mistaken. 
it's ROG for Asus and ROC for Phoenix. I don't know what they are, but ROC, it's a kind of a modded version of Phoenix. If you don't know about that, I'll be showing you just Phoenix OS ROC V5. And then you can go ahead and check it out. Uh, don't worry, the link of this thread will be also in the description, so you can go ahead and check it out. So they say that the gaming performance is increased, etc, etc, updated Octopus and stuff like that. I tried it, you know, I tried the version 4, there is version 5 available right now, the final release the latest version i tried the version 4 and it says there were so much bug fixes this that optimus per uh, system app ram usage blah 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 but i just tried it you know it's so much freaking big in size it's, it was around like one gigabyte yes you can see 1090 megabytes i downloaded it installed it and installing it is also a bit uh complex I didn't install it and then I downloaded PUBG and I started playing but there was no any significant difference but the only drawback that I found in here was that my microphone was not working and even my internet connection even though I have a very fast not really fast I have a very moderate internet connection even the speed was not consistent it was uh, good sometimes it was bad sometimes and I was just so much totally tensed up and even though there are some add-ons that you can use like uh, for example the nfs injector as you can see right there performance tuning so there is nfs injector there's the magic module i tried this there was no uh better in performance so i would suggest you i did try these things all these ROC versions myself, but I never found any significant difference, not at all. Only I found was degradation in performance. But if you are facing like problems like your microphone is not working on the official version of Phoenix, then I would suggest you can go ahead and try the uh, ROC version. Who knows, it might be working for you. But for me, nothing is different in the V5 or V4, whatever there is. I am very much happy with the official version of Phoenix. It's quite light. I removed many of the applications that are pre-installed, as you can see right here. Even I have made a video about that, how you can remove all your bloatwares or the application that's come pre-installed, which are not useful. So yeah, guys, this is really important. Even I was thinking that uh, maybe Phoenix ROC is more uh, better because as you can say the change log that says that uh graphics api updated game performance increased it doesn't do anything if you don't believe me you can go ahead and try it you can download it it's 578 uh, sorry 878 megabytes you can install downloaded it and then you have to just um replace some files you can do that but it won't work and one more thing is that you might think that increasing performance by using ext4, the file format ext4, but frankly speaking, there is no performance increase in that. Uh, my laptop is quite a new one. I bought it in 2018. The specs will be in the description as well. So I tried it in ext4, but it was so hilarious. My whole phoenix was like stuttering for two three seconds and then it was working again again something like opening up something it will just wait for two three seconds and then again opening up it was very inconsistent even the gaming was not good it was slower it was not good and i am very much happy with ntfs system it's just faster more reliable and it's more easier to backup and just do things like that just cut the data.img folder from phoenix os to somewhere else uninstall or upgrade whatever you want to do to the file and then replace the data.img and you're done it's so much as simple as that so i want to uh as a honest youtuber and as an honest uh helper i really love all of you for supporting me so much and that's why i'm making this video for you so this is it guys this is the best version of phoenix i want to say that that is really great i've been using it since uh it was uh launched and then i upgraded to 3.5 but i regretted that, so i came back and i want to urge everyone to come back this is the best version and it's just working really really great so that's 
that's it guys so if you got any queries you know how to reach me there's the comment box down below go ahead ask me whatever you want to ask i will answer and reply each and every individual so you know me how i am so this is abd rv bro signing out from phoenix os or tech tweak what you want to say so that's pretty much it guys hope you really like this and hope this video was useful for you um you know if you got queries you know how to reach me this is abd signing out do subscribe do like do share these videos with others because you know these are really important uh to know because most of you might not know how this thing works so yeah that's it this is abd signing out from tech tweak Hope this day was good and the coming days will be better. Bye-bye and God bless you all. Thank you.